Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. For those who are new to my channel, I am Key. So real quick, I want, I have so many videos to show you guys. <sighs> I have a Shein, uh, Shot Miss A, well, pretty much everything Shein, okay? So yeah, um, and one of the hauls or one of the videos that we're gonna be doing today is a hair video. So if you see this outfit a couple of times, that's because I got a bunch of stuff to show you guys. I just realized I've been buying all these wigs and I have yet to come and show you guys um, the units. So I decided to come and show you guys today. So this one that I'm gonna show you is from Eunice Hair. I think I am pronouncing it correctly. It is a honey blonde mix vibe. It is a full lace wig. Um, I'll try to screenshot some of the specs of this unit and post it somewhere up here or over here so you can see it but yeah okay so when I first got this wig I was real skeptical because I thought I did my homework but I didn't and then I looked I ordered this from Amazon it's from Uni, Eunice hair but I got it from Amazon just because I use Claritin because I got a payment plan on there and see so you can pay it six months out because I have about another week with that which I'll be doing a review in a later date because I'm not gonna change my hair today <laughs> so but I bought this wig and I looked at the reviews on Amazon and they were saying like this wig is too thin the color mix wasn't what it was supposed to be don't buy this wig uh, it didn't do you know just a whole bunch of different stuff so I'm the type of person normally typically before I buy a wig it literally takes me about two months to buy a wig because I'm looking at all these different reviews from different websites different uh, people just different reviews about the hair before i invest my money into the hair so i finally decided to buy this wig i was like okay it's either gonna work it's not gonna work first of all i took a chance on this wig because i don't do full lace wigs i normally do a five by five or a four by four party but this is a full lace wig honey and this wig is laid i did not bleach the knots i did not do nothing i probably could have bleached the knots and i didn't because if you get like close 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 on me you could kind of see the lace but for the most part honey i laid this wig down for somebody that don't know how to lay melt so light melt lace I, I i laid this down it did come with three combs it came with two on the side one in the back i cut the combs out y'all know i've been doing it for years i do not keep the combs in these wigs just because i love my edges and i be feeling like it take my edges out um but yeah it's a cute short vibe i i'm in love with this color mix so at first when I seen this color mix, it didn't look like the color mix that was on the page. It looked a little darker. So when I seen this, it kind of looked it kind of brighter. So I was kind of intimidated. And then I'm always intimidated by roots when it comes to roots. Because I feel like roots should be a little darker. But these weren't as dark. So I really took a chance on that as well. How it came is how it came. But it ended up being so freaking pretty. I'm not mad at that. Now, I didn't put no concealer in that part, which I'll probably go in and do before I leave the house today. I started putting concealer right here at the top right here, but I didn't go all the way back. But this unit is everything. I am starting to get into blunts. I'm, okay, so I always love my basic black hair because when you wear black hair, you can't go wrong. But I have been looking for bobs to wear because I need bobs. I need something short and not so heavy and, and big on my head. So I was looking for bobs number one number two um i was looking for i've been looking for color because my husband my, my fiance he loves blonde hair he loves anything i wear honey because you know you know <laughs> she can rock anything but he loves blonde he loves honey blonde he loves blonde and what i've been noticing is blonde actually looks good on me it doesn't it doesn't wash me out it doesn't look bad i can i can do a blonde color in rocky so this is really really pretty like i said it's a kind of like a honey golden blonde mix and i think this is like 10 inches but i think this unit is 10 inches long perfect vibe for the summer i wish i would have got this vibe when the summer first started because it's just perfect i am going to be investing in more bob units i said i was gonna go check out amazon um after 
uh, I take my, cause I'm going to get my hair done on the 28th. I'm going to get some spring twists. So after I take my hair down from that style, I'm probably going to go look and invest in more vibes. Cause I am really feeling these vibes and I'm really feeling these blonde vibes, honey. They give me like, cause I, here's my thing. If I'm going to invest in a vibe, I've bought so many synthetic vibes. Now, don't get me wrong. I still love my synthetic wigs because sometimes some colors you just can't get unless you play an astronomical price. So, I like to be able to go back to my synthetic, you know, colors, my synthetic wigs when I'm looking for a particular color. But I want something that I could just put on every day. I could add heat to it. I could throw some crimps in here. I could throw some curls in here. And the hair will be fine. I could add heat to this if need be. And when it starts getting old or looking old, I can wash it, shampoo it, conditioner it, and bring it back to life. You can't do that too many times with a synthetic wig. If you can do it at all. So I'm really starting to put my money more and invest in my money more into human hair wigs. Now this wig was... Was it 90? I think it was 90 bucks. I think it was $96 for this wig. And I don't mind that at all. It is 150 density. A lot of people say it was a little thin. But to me, it's not that thin. To me, I feel like it's just right. Because you don't want your hair to look too bulky and look too full. So for me, this unit was perfect. I like that it's not so much hair on there. I don't feel like I'm going to be sweating this hair out. And I've learned a new technique to melting my lace down. So, this has been helping me too. <laughs> so, yeah. But definitely go check out Eunice Hair. I will be coming to you guys with a strawberry blonde unit. I got it from them. I don't know how I feel about this one yet. Because this color didn't look like... It definitely didn't look like the color um, on the packaging. Um, it was a little darker. And I feel like the hair is a little thinner. Um, so I know that if I buy a long unit from long unit again in the future, which I definitely am, it won't be from them because I don't like the, I don't like the, I don't like it. I don't like the thinness of the hair, but for a vibe, I, I really like it, but I will be bringing you that review probably this weekend. I think I'm going to wear that hair this weekend. I'm going to curl it and do some things with it. Um, so be looking for that, um, review. If not, it'll definitely, it'll be coming up in the near future. So I can't promise y'all to be this weekend because y'all are getting to the lazy modes and I don't want to do nothing. But yeah, if you're looking for a nice, cute, blonde bob or a bob in the blonde family, definitely check out Eunice Hair. This was definitely worth the money. Also, y'all, even just check out Amazon, period, because Amazon typically has really, really nice units for the low low. Um, I've seen a couple of more units that I want to invest in that I am going to invest in that are really, really nice units. So, yeah, I'm going to get out of here. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Remember to think smart, spend smarter, and have fun planning it all out. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.